Rated M for Mature. We've all been there with a few Fairburn fails, haven't we? Here are five you've definitely done at least once. Not good enough. Better try again. Sniper Elite 4 is a game about, more or less, looking really cool while you single-handedly turn the tide on Germany's ascendancy in World War II. When everything goes right, it's a ballet of slow-motion bullets, clueless enemies and rapidly weakening Axis power. But we're not here to talk about everything going right. This video is about the muck-ups we've all made in Sniper Elite 4 that become a bit of a rite of passage, sending us on our way to becoming better, happier, healthier long-range soldiers with glossier coats and wetter noses. Don't feel bad if you've made more than one of these. I've done all five. Imagine how I feel. Getting there. Need more practice. Shooting at a group is first on our list of Sniper Elite 4 boo-boos. And I don't mean wantonly opening fire at a cluster of troops. Come on, this is a stealthy sniper game, who would do that? Hmm, no, I'm talking about that very specific temptation you get to take the long shot at an exposed soldier, even though you know his mates nearby will definitely notice his head exploding. It's not your fault though, is it? I mean, look how inviting this setup is. It would take an absolute iron will not to just pull the trigger here and deal with the stealth-breaking consequences later. Fortunately, an iron will is exactly what several hours of being hunted down by Hitler's underlings will give you, and eventually you learn to lure people away from groups, use sand masks and hide bodies. Reckon I could take this fellow down without making a noise. Admittedly, Entry 2 is quite specific, but who among us hasn't taken damage walking in the vague vicinity of a tank or armoured personnel carrier as it explodes several seconds after we thought it had exploded? It's these little moments that unite us, fellow Fairburns. It's a dastardly trick they pull, a bit like a track-bound iron predator letting off its final nuke to prove it's top of the food chain, even if someone kills it. Watch as they play dead, then lure you back to them before the last damage-dealing payload goes off. Yeah, we've all been there. Pick the shrapnel out of your fleshy bits and move on, as the famous saying goes. Tanks, they aren't taking any chances. Sniper rifles are brilliant, brilliant things. Suppressed ammo is also brilliant. Anyone would want to use this combo all level long, popping off enemies from their first vantage point to the final target, and you could hardly hold it against them, mostly because you know the pain of running completely out of suppressed ammo. This is a mistake you make only once or twice before committing to memory that suppressed ammo is precious, and targets who can be taken down with a well-placed stone, a cunning whistle, or acts of absolute melee barbarism should be taken down as such. Maybe I need some practice with suppressed ammo. You factored in bullet drop, wind speed and direction, the exact time of day, and you know, you've basically directed this sniper rifle kill like Spielberg. It's gonna be magnificent. And then, at the exact moment you pull the trigger, you realize you didn't have suppressed ammo equipped. Bang goes your cover, everything turns red, out come more troops like combat trained fascist water flowing out of a nasty tap. It wasn't supposed to be like this. You lined up the perfect kill. Make sure you've got the right ammo type equipped next time, eh? Hmm. Suppressed ammo. Interesting. We're finishing on an even more specific one than all the others, but hey, it's my list, I do what I like, you can't stop me. Number five is shooting bombs plain at the end before it leaves the runway. And yes, yes, you can finish the game just as easily by doing it this way as the other, which I'll get to momentarily. It's academic really, and from a purely military tactic standpoint, it is a good idea to neutralise a fleeing Nazi madman as swiftly as absolutely possible. But if you do shoot the engines on the runway and blow it up before it takes flight, you rob yourself of this lovely long shot when it circles back around in the air, presents its bomb and makes a beeline for you. It's one of the most satisfying shots in the whole game, and it's only made by the patient Sniper Elite 4 player. Time to meet your maker. We laughed, we cried, mistakes were made along the way. Make sure you don't make the biggest mistake of all and go missing one of our vids by smashing that subscribe button and turning on notifications. As always, we really do like reading the comments in these videos to hear your own entries to the list, so leave them below. And if you really want to make our day, hit that like button to let us know you enjoyed the vid. Catch you in the next one.